Thank you. Some Portland city officials making it difficult for Portland food cart owners to sell liquor to customers in the future. Coin Local 6 reporter Jenny Hansen is here with more on this. And Jenny, basically, Portland wants the OLCC to alter its rules regarding this? Yes, they do. They basically ask the liquor officials to only grant short term licenses when appropriate, say, for a beer festival or special event. Now, this comes just weeks after the Cartlandia food cart pod on Southeast 82nd started serving beer and wine to customers. It took a long time to get that approved by the OLCC. That was after Portland City officials objected to the Cartlandia liquor license application. It was filed almost a year ago, and they were concerned it would open the door to licenses for the nearly 698 food carts across the Portland area. The OLCC just approved Cartlandia's license last month, and since then, Cartlandia owner Roger Goldengay says they've invested a lot of money in making the changes necessary to serve customers. He says that the city's latest move to block them from doing that is discouraging. And I think it's important that uh, normal people can feel like they can come and have a beer with their burger and not, not feel like there's some sort of criminal element. I think that's very important to neighborhood change. The OLCC will take public comments on this proposed rule change through May 11th. Now, as it stood, the approval last month did have some restrictions. It could only be served in a fenced in spot, a beer garden like structure, and only during certain hours. Now, since the OLCC issued Cartlandia an annual license, it is very unlikely that it would be revoked in the meantime unless there are any violations. Reporting for you, Jenny Hansen, Coin Local 6.